Hey, this is Steve from BC Barker Creations, and uh, figured I'd give you guys a quick update. These are our uh, first five leopard geckos of the season, and uh, they're all giants. The the breeding was a uh, tangerine or a giant tangerine tremper albino bred to two hyper xanthic possible het trembers so so far we haven't proved them out yet but this guy's in shed and I mean they're 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 just gorgeous but I show you differences in them I mean they're pretty basic geckos but if you take a look at these two these two are the most recent the hatch and they just shut out and they are bright Let's see if we can get this little guy over here and here and show you the difference in the, in the coloring uh, it might be hard to see but in person those two over there are just so much brighter yellow and orange than this one. Really nice. So while I'm doing the update, I'll give you a little shot of the incubators. In here we've got, uh, these are all being temp sex for female. Other than these are uh, a couple of clutches of milii in there. We got some rainwater stuff. Uh, what's that? Giant over there and Bell Sun Glow in there. These are t being temp sex female right now. And over here we got some stuff that's transitioning that have been temp sex female already. It's just a little bit warmer incubator. So you slowly bring them up. These are all. Uh, Temp sex female. We got bandits over there. Uh, another bell sun glow there. That's a monster. That's the my daughter named a monster. It's a uh, uh, Max Snow Hat Bell Andy Clips. Is the male, and he's being bred to. Let's see, a uh, bell albino and. So we got a uh, cinnamon bred to blonde lesser and a bumblebee. I think there's seven eggs for that clutch. Uh, we got a bunch of stuff up here. Let's see what we got up here. These are bandits that are uh, temp sex male. Here's another one of the monster. That's temp sex female. These are all giants that were, yep, temp sex female. Um, this is an oops clutch. Huh. I thought that uh, I had three females in there and it ended up being two females and a male. It's a tangerine 66% hat radar times a super hypo tangerine hat bell and a uh, bell sun glow. So. It's gonna be good stuff anyways. We got more bandits, temp sex female. Uh, what else we got over here? Uh, rainwaters, temp sex male. Rainwater, temp sex female. Giants, temp sex male. Those are two, two males I'm gonna keep and just grow up. And there's uh, another monster uh, clutch, temp sex. Male also, there's there's like four clutches in most of these, and most other than them little containers. But then we got uh, spotted python eggs there, nine eggs. You guys saw the video of that. Then we got a dinker that looks like a leopard that was bred to the blonde lesser. Three huge eggs. And there, I mean they're they're like each egg's like size of two. 
but uh, that's it for an incubator right now. I got a bunch of stuff that's uh, still laying and gonna be laying. Um, all I know, we're gonna show you some isopods. All right, these are our isopods. We uh, we're looking for an alternative feeder because we can't keep up with our mealworms. So. These guys seem to be breeding pretty good too. There's a bunch of isopods in there. Just for an alternative, we I don't know, we don't we got a lot of mealworms, but they take so long to grow that uh we need other stuff. And we also got the dubia roaches too. But, but these are different. Most people I don't think have these, but uh these here are common European isopods. Right in there. And these over here are giant canyon isopods, which they're, uh, the canyon ones seem to bury themselves more. If I can find one, there's a baby, I don't know if you can see it, little one. Oh, oh there's one right in there. Solcata enclosure where our tortoises are over there. Lots of room for them to move. It's just a big one of those stock tanks. But, uh, let's get a close up. Oh, you're gonna hide. Alright some more updates pretty soon thanks for watching